how to graph equations of the form y equals c, where c is a constant, by hand. This is part of the Family of Functions series. You will need graph paper or you can download this PDF and print it. Press pause as needed anytime. Let's graph y equals 5. We'll use a table and we need to find ordered pairs that satisfy or work in this equation y equals 5. For example, the ordered pair 4 comma 5 has a y coordinate of 5, so we can put that in the table and plot it over 4 up 5. A second example is negative 3 comma 5 and we can put that in the table and also plot that one. Pause and find three more ordered pairs and plot those. Press pause as needed. Resume when you're ready. Our three ordered pairs are 8, 5, 0, 5, negative 6.1 comma 5, and we use the negative 6.1 to show that you don't always have to have integers. There's definitely a pattern in the table. 5 in each of the y coordinates, and also a pattern in the graph. All five of the points are along the same line or are collinear. Connect the points, and this is the line we get. How would you describe this line? Please press pause and resume when you're ready. It is a horizontal line because it does go along the horizon. And it also is a line that has a slope and the slope is the number zero. Second example, let's graph y equals negative six. Again, using a table. We need to find ordered pairs that satisfy or work in this equation. Y equals negative six. One such ordered pair would be five comma negative six because it has a y coordinate of negative six. So we put that in the table and we plot it. A second ordered pair would be negative three comma negative six. So we'll plot that one. Please press pause and find three more ordered pairs and plot those. Press pause and resume when you're ready. Our three ordered pairs are negative seven comma negative six, zero negative six, and 2.4 comma negative six. Connect the points. Again, how would you describe this line? Pause and resume when you're ready. It is a horizontal line. It moves along the horizon and it is a line that has a slope of zero. Final example, graph y equals negative three halves. And we're gonna ask you to do this a final example before we summarize our findings and generalize. So using a table, pause to do this example and resume when you are finished. So putting in y equals negative three halves for every single ordered pair, we can put any numbers in for x because they're not defined in the equation at all. And then we can go ahead and plot those five points. Connect the points. And again, describing the line, it is a horizontal line. It moves along the horizon and it has a slope of zero. So let's now summarize and generalize. Each of these graphs are graphs of equations of the form y equals c, where c is some constant. Each of these lines is a horizontal line. And horizontal lines do have a slope of zero. Each line also has a y-intercept at the point with coordinate zero comma whatever the constant is. For example, for y equals 5, 0, 5. For y equals negative 6, 0, negative 6 is the y-intercept. 
and at y equals negative 3 halves, 0 comma negative 3 halves is the y-intercept. Now you try 1. Graph y equals 4. Press pause to do this and then resume when you're finished to check your answer. And so it is a horizontal line. The slope of this line is 0. And these are some of the ordered pairs that are on this line. And you can see that the y-coordinate is always 4.